Hey all my planikers, the friends Xelix are here and welcome back to another episode of Park Spotlight. In today's episode we are looking at Kun Kingdom created by Adam and this is a very old submission from 2017 but this was one of those that got lost and therefore we are looking at it right now. It says here, this is my first time box park. I started the week of Planet Coaster's release in its current state. It's 75% complete with 582 hours invested in it. Enjoy. Uh, it hasn't been updated since. So that's why uh, you know I decided, okay, let's just uh, do the park. And it's not finished, but it's like a, a quarter of it isn't finished. It's an exact quarter of the park that isn't finished. So 75% of it is completely finished. It looks beautiful, it's a really big park, uh, so let's just get into it. Okay, welcome back everybody, we are here at the entrance of Kun Kingdom. Let's get in here. I don't think there is any guests, we get like 14 FPS, it's a huge park. Here we are at the entrance, and remember, this is mostly without any DLC. Maybe a few, but not that many. Look at this. And this is like uh, an archaeologist <laughs> digging up bones from a dinosaur. It's amazing to see, you know, the stuff people did just when the game came out. It's amazing. Look at all this. Big drop tower in the middle. Oh, let's go here. Let's take a left. We'll cross there when we get there. But you know, there's music everywhere. Is the carousel in here? Yes, it is. Look at all the candy everywhere. Oh, there's a fast lane here. And there it is. Carousel. Wow, look at all that. So much color. Okay, let's go on. And everything still works. That's also amazing after all the updates. Okay, let's go like this way. What is there to the right? Oh, let's just keep on going. Wow. What the? That's a coaster. All custom supports. Gotta remember, I mean, it submitted somewhere in 2017. The game came out in 2016, of course. See what's over here. I like it. Looks really cool. Okay, let's get on the main road, I guess. What is this city? Sunny Square. Okay. <laughs> So playful, there's music everywhere. On Sunny Square. Nice, can sit here in the shade. That's fantastic. I don't know why the shops are all closed, actually. Why is that? Oh, okay, they're just not... Hmm. Let me have a look, actually, if I can open up all the shops, because it looks very uh, empty. Okay, this should solve some of our issues. All the shops should now be open. Oh, it wasn't really an issue, but... Ah, oh, here we go. Giant uh, clock tower. Park Plaza. Wonderwood. Westworld. Cool. 
Okay, let's keep on going. Let's get the Wonderwood. So much fun. Wonderwood. Like, there's music everywhere in this park. Look at all the decoration. I mean, to be honest, this is way better than a lot of stuff I see nowadays. <laughs> Not the... Uh, you know, if I look at the inbox sometimes now... Yeah, it's, it's, it's... You know, sometimes we get really weird creation. And people sending coasters without any theming. Just bare-bone coasters. And you're just like, wow. You know? And then you see this really old stuff from 2017 and clearly an amazing builder with Adam. So cool to see. And this is mostly without DLCs. Castle Cruiser. Look at all the detail in the queue line, all the grapevines here. Looks amazing, and I bet it looks great at night. Yep, there we go. We go up here. Wow, cool. Really nicely done cues. And here we are. So we've got a junior Wendigo and here are the results. I'm just going to put it in test mode and oh, there is one on the track already. So let's go for this one. Let's go. Okay, we are back! Just a fun, nice kitty ride. Castle Cruiser, very nice. Let's open it back up again for the people. And let's get out of here. I like it with the Porticulis. Drawbridge. I like these planks as well, yeah. Look at all the detail. Gold bee, chief beef in the tents, all the little plants and the fountain and great work. And I guess with you know you didn't have all the temple pieces to block everything up and all that kind of stuff. So you know such a creative way. And look here, double paw thing looking out over the lake. It's amazing. All the elevation in here as well. Little scenes everywhere. Coon Kingdom. Really amazing stuff in here. 
Wow, look at all the depth everywhere. Let me turn it back to day. Even though it looks just amazing at night. And there we go. Twirling teacups. Look at all the detail here. On the queue, it's the waterfall coming down. It's amazing. And here is the entrance. I know I went through the exit, but it's just a, a teacup, so... Look at all this. This... Four teacups, right? Now, that is some real dedication right here. <laughs> That's how you build. That's just stunning. Oh, we've got a path through here as well. Just a little village. Information kiosk. There's cameras there. Everywhere. Keep an eye on those pesky thieves in Planko. So much clutter and detail everywhere. Wow. Did we miss anything right here? Oh, the entrance there. And we've got another coaster. Okay, let's get in here. Manic Mill. Nice queue with the uh, rock overhang. It's even like blowing dust in the rocks. Oh, look how riggedy this path is. This looks amazing. Wow. I'm gonna say it again and again, I guess. Uh, here we go. Manic Mill. Hold up. It's a uh, crazy one. Looney turns. And here are the results. Bit high on the verticals, but hey. Yep, that for sure was crazy, but wow, what a amazing detail in the uh, in all the clutter everywhere. Look at all this, and here in the barn, it's just stunning going through here. Look at all the details, and I bet it looks great at night. Yep. Actually, maybe it would have been better at night, but uh, it's mean, yeah. It's what you find out later, right? So, look at all the custom... <sighs> wow. This is so crazy. Great job on this, Adam. So yeah, let's go on here. Super cool. Let's change it back to daytime for a bit. There we are. 
That just triggers everywhere. No wonder, like, you couldn't finish this. I mean, that's probably the case. What is in here? I wonder. Oh, I've got a train. Cool. Uh, let's not go on there now. Is that Westworld? I bet. Yep. Look at all the detail. Everywhere. So crazy. Every fence has detail on it. Westworld. I just want to know if we're done with this area before we go anywhere. This looks so good. Already. Can't wait to go to Westworld. <laughs> and this is how we do theme as well, you know? It's just so much detail everywhere. What is this? Is this still part of Sunny Square? Yeah, it is. So let's just continue on through Sunny Square. Let's see what else there is here. All the little streets, so much fun. Wait, this is... Uh... Oh no, this is Stuka one. Aha. Uh -huh. I thought it was Temple Piece. Look at this. A restaurant. So great. All the little shops here and then you can sit out there. Perfect. And is this the main square? I think so. Yes, it is. Okay, so we're not done, I think, in this area. Let me have a look. Okay, here is another area starting. And what is this? Is this also Westworld? Yes, I think so. Okay, so let's quickly dip into back here. Okay, so this is more the backside staff area, I guess, with all the uh, bins laying around. Yeah, let's go through the uh, big Westwood uh, entrance, Westworld. Uh, where was it? There. Here we are. Look at that sign. Let's get in here. I, I don't even have to put music underneath this. There's just music everywhere you look. Or walk. <laughs> what have we got here? Oh, that's the exit. Look at all the little streets everywhere. Well, everything is crossing over into each other. This is so much fun. Really well done. A high hammer. Look at all this. Big canyon down there. Ooh, we got a coaster. Reminds me a bit of Dynamite Dunes. Look at all the detail here. All the clutter in there. So much foliage everywhere, everywhere is thought of. Boom, and there we are, the high hammer. Nice view, that's for sure. Then we get this giant mountain. 
Let's just get back. Wow, look at that with the train. Calamity Canyon. Looks so good. Near the station. So much detail. Flowers everywhere. Look at this. With all the brackets. And look at this train station. Okay, let's get on this ride. This must have taken so long to construct. Uh, people love this ride. I only let a thousand people in, but I guess a lot of them are here. Boom. Great looking station. Okay, what do we got? Uh, so we got the uh, Canyon Runner and here are the results. Let's uh, sit in, not this one. We're gonna sit in this one and let's do it front bumper. Wow, there's just so much done right in this park. It's insane. It's really, from the detail here in the station, just to all the craziness that was going on on the coaster. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, let's get off here right now when we get back in. There we go. I mean, let's let's just have a look at this. I mean, for sure this was an amazing centerpiece of a coaster for, for this area, right? And we just dive down and look at all the custom work along the coaster, first of all. And then just all the detail, the custom supports here. All the sort of mining that went on here. Then we've got all the crazy rocks with all the 
dead trees, everything is thought of. Then we've got even animatronics lining the walls with the tentacles and everything st coming out. Uh, you don't see them now, but they are there. And the Kraken, of course, comes out and then triggered lights in the caves. Look how far this goes as well. There we go. There we see the tentacles. And there is the Kraken waiting underneath the water. But just the... Uh, yeah, we went through here, I think. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's just so well done. Look at the scope of everything. Oh, and this was the uh, triggered light sequence when we went through here, I think. Maybe. Anyway, really great job on this one. Just amazing work. And this is the unfinished area. So this is the, the other 25% of the park. Everything else is done. And I don't think you can do much more because I put it to medium and I'm running 13 to 15 FPS. So yeah. We completely understand that it's impossible <laughs> to do anymore. Oh, this crosses over into here? That's cool. More shops. Some toilets. I like it as well. You covered up the toilets. They're not just these ugly boxes. Water over there. Train yard. Okay, let's go here. What is this? The exit? I guess. Look at this as well. And this is how you do Western, everyone. This makes Western interesting. If you're thinking about building a Western park, get your inspiration from this this park. Kun Kingdom. Really well done. Gold Rush Gambit. What are you? It's probably a flat ride, but you never know. Let's have a look. What it is. It's a giant queue. That's for sure. What are you? Oh, we got a car. Um, hold the phone. Let's do this. Uh, Gold Rush Gambit. Let me sit in... No. This one. Should we do this at night? No, I think maybe day. Should be okay.
Oh, they dug too deep and unleashed the Kraken. Mostly uh, storytelling on there as well. Really nicely done. Okay, let's get to that coaster that we saw. Is this the one? Cobra Coral? Oh, I bet this is the one. So much fun doing this part. Uh, and uh, I saw it a couple of weeks ago uh, when it you know, was in the inbox and it's, oh, it looks interesting, but it was so huge. So I was like, okay, I need to have like a bit of time to, you know, get through it and just be focused on it. And now that I'm doing it and I, I just love this park. So well done. But this was one of the ones that got lost in uh, some kind of Google form incident. And then miraculously recovered. Such a shame that uh, it couldn't be featured earlier, but hey, you know, that's how it goes. And we get to see it now, which is amazing. And I think this should be a... Uh, this is a really inspiring park, that's for sure. Like, I haven't seen Western done like this very often. There we are. So we got Cobra Coral. It's a launched torque coaster. And here are the results. So let's wait for the next one to come into the station and then we'll go for a ride. <laughs> Crazy coaster. Oh, it was fun. Wow. Cobra Coral. Let's get off here. And maybe we've been through the entire western part of this uh, park. I don't know. We have to see. But that would mean that we are going to another part. Let's see how that's going to work. Let's see what's back here. Oh, wow. Look at that. Yeah, this is for sure the edge. And let me have a look. I'm just gonna go back to the plaza, I think. Like the main main plaza, and then we'll take it from there. Westway whistle. Oh wait, there's a train here, but this is just a normal train, I think. Right? Yeah, that's just a train station. Okay. There's a monorail in there as well. Okay, let's just get back here. Okay, we didn't... So we're on top of here now. And maybe let's go to the right. Let's, let's do that now. Okay, let's have a look over here. Gift shops. Okay, cool. This looks like a little lookout place. And um, 
I don't know, I had to reload the park, so all the shops and stuff were closed again, so I'm not, I'm not gonna fin fix it now, it's just... <laughs> So much work, and the park takes a while to load up, so let's just keep going. What have we got over here? Again, beautiful buildings, custom roofs everywhere. All the small details. Look at that. 11 FPS, here we go. <laughs> And I want to know what that coaster is all about, because that just looks crazy. Okay. Here we are. It's looking great. Look at all this. So much detail everywhere. Wow. High bright hilltop. The black bog. Uh, yeah, let's go. Ooh, completely different area. Really like the lanterns. Swamp swirl. Got flat right here. And again, so much detail. <laughs> what? Look at this. All the custom floors. This is nuts. Black boa. Oh, cool. Is it a coaster? I think so. Yeah, it is. Okay. Um, so I'm guessing we're not going to see stats on these. Oh, we do. Good. Okay. So, um, yeah, here are the stats. And we're just going to test it in seat view. Let's go. Nice coaster. Going through the swamp. I do wanna just have a look at this. Oops. During the day. Let me have a look. Cause or actually, you know what? Let's go here to the back. Ah oh, yeah, okay. I was wondering if it was better day or night, but I don't know. It's uh, tough to say. Mm. Oh, sorry about the FPS, everyone. But it's nothing I can do about this. Toilets. There we 
even dropping to seven. Like these paths are just killing it. <laughs> wow. I'm gonna try not to turn too much. This looks cool. The graveyard. Wow. Okay, I restarted uh, NVIDIA Shadow Play, so I guess my mic was a bit messed up for a bit there. Uh, should be fixed now, so. Okay, what do we have here? Like these uh, seats here with the uh, little bit of shade. Ooh. Nicely covered up with the straw. Oh my god, this is almost unbearable. I'm so sorry, guys. I Maybe I can... I'm just going to drop it to low because this is really not doable. Okay, okay, we got 15 now. Now, it still drops down. Are these cost... Of, I mean, this is just unbelievable. I'm gonna go up a little bit and see where we can go here. Look at that, looks great. But it's really unbearable recording-wise. Oh, the Mad Mansion. What is this? Oh, it's a... Uh, it's a Wendigo. It looks cool here, though. Maybe we should look at it at night. Uh, that's probably better. Okay, let's go. Ooh. Creepy. Okay, uh, so what have we got? Mad Mansion, of course, it's a junior dragon. And here are the results. Let's put in test mode and then we'll take a ride.
Cool, very nice dark ride here. Wow, this is um, a lot better than uh, most dark rides I see like on an actual Huntsman ride, so uh, really well done on this one. People always make the dark rides so samey and uh, this was really cool and different. And you made this like in the one of the first years it came out, which is even cooler. Uh, let's set it back to daytime. I'm a bit lost. Mm, let's see where we are at. Okay. So we've been here and we've got some more shops there. We haven't seen this yet. It looks cool with the water uh, transported from there. And I'm guessing we have a, a rickety rapids. Okay. Let's get on it. Again, just themed all over the place. I mean, people, please, like, make a smaller park, but theme it like this. This is amazing to watch. And this guy did it in the first years Blanco came out. There's no, or not a lot of DLC, you know, there's no TMTK, none of that you need. Just make this stunning. Look at the nature work. This looks like I'm in a forest anywhere in the world look at that this is how you theme in planko uh rickety rapids here are the results and we're gonna hop into the first there we go oh that's also not the one it was guest facing i don't know why i didn't turn <laughs> Okay, let's uh, enjoy this uh, River Rapids.
and we are back that was amazing I love this Adam great job I mean I was just thinking about it and I was even thinking I'm just gonna go to the intro and say that people have to watch this all the way just to see all your theming it's absolutely impeccable theming everything is themed in here that nothing you forgot it's amazing and now we're gonna go to this bad boy iron industry like look at all this like how many pieces is this 328 it's not even that much i mean it's a lot but it's not even that much uh but just all the little pieces you know just to make everything custom this is amazing completely new area and there's another area back there holy crap this video is gonna be so long look everything is covered up the benches so you can sit here out of the sun all the pipes the smoke coming out water you thought of everything Eastway Express, okay. Uh, wait, let me have a look at this station. That looks cool. Look at those supports. This is how you custom support, guys. Wow. Look at all the detail in the back as well. See that? Look at that. Okay, let's get on this coaster. I really want to ride this thing. Um, where is the entrance, though? This must be the exit. Maybe. Wow, look at all this thing. So nuts. Woohoo! Even they agree. Okay, how do we get in there? This looks like another section. Is it somewhere here? <laughs> Look at this. So crazy. I love it. Just trying to find the entrance to your coaster here let's have a look um, it's not it right it's not here no this is just the Where is it sorry by going through your build Maybe it's here? Oh, look at that. Oh, here it is. King Kani. Or Kanai. Wow. Just take the uh, normal route. Does it go through here? I guess so. Um, get an up here. Love those lights. And this is one of the best queues I've ever seen. Sorry guys, the FPS is so bad, but what are you gonna do? I've said it before, but like, no wonder <laughs> Adam couldn't finish this. Uh, yeah, this is a, a whole nother level of crazy. And detail, look at even this, holding up the pipes, the, all the little brackets. Wow. 
Pipes crossing and everything makes sense as well, which is really cool. Super immersive queue. And there we are. Okay, well, this is gonna be a bit choppy, I guess, but uh, what are you gonna do? So we've got a uh, Giga Invincible, and here are the results. Green across the board, good stats. Let's uh, put it into test. Seed view, and let's do this. This was uh, the best coaster so far, 100%. The theming is amazing. We go so high up, all the custom supports, so gnarly with all the sound effects. This was amazing to write. Wow. And I'm just thinking about this park. I think this is my favorite park of the year so far. Like, I haven't... I have seen really good parks, but personally, this is just my favorite. Just the amount of detail everywhere. This is amazing. Nothing isn't detailed, worked at, thought out. It's amazing what you did here. What's going on back here? Fiery Forge? Ah, oh, it's a flat ride. Cool. I gotta change it back to the low settings are just ugly as hell. There we go. That's a lot better. And the FPS doesn't really change now, actually, now that I thought about it. Uh, I mean, 
my computer you know should be ha be able to handle the full park and a bit but it's just the game limitations at this moment like the engine just it cannot do more than what you did here just the engine just bogs down so that's what we have to deal with okay what is this here is this also part oh cool Okay, yeah, let's see how we get there. Look at all the detail everywhere. The pipes, the chains holding them up. Look at that building. Oh. There we go. Just the canals you made. All the little triggers everywhere. How do we get into this... Uh... Speed street. There we go. Let's take the priority lane now. Oh, wow, look at all the tires. Again, all the details are just... I'm just gonna get in through here. Okay, uh, is this day or night? Let's see, what do we think here? Could be night. Let's try it. Um, oh, but then we're gonna need people, right? Yeah, that's not gonna happen because we don't have any. Okay, uh, then we're just gonna go along the track. And let's see what it's all about. Cool. I like it. I mean, it's called Iron Industry and you just theme that like all the signs amazing you covered all or you not didn't really cover it up but you place the signs there oops let's not select the uh, track high voltage <laughs> that's cool going through here all the sound effects you put in here yep really trying to go a bit slow for you guys so it's a bit manageable Low clearance. I like all the blue lights in there. Look at that. The supports holding it up. That's so cool. Dip down. I wonder what you do for a living. Like if you work in the um, theme park industry or if you do something with I don't know, design or like coming up with, uh, you know, all these themes. I mean, it's it seems like or you just have a good eye for it, but like everything makes sense in this place, which is uh, something you don't see often. Like you do see often, but not into like this level of detail. Look at this. So much work. And we're not even back yet. And there we are. At the finish. Okay. Cool. Amazing as well. Sadly, we couldn't really ride it, but hey. I'm just going to take a bird's eye view here because, I mean, this park is so big. I, I, I'm kind of lost. Um, okay, let's switch it over to daytime for a second as well. So I have a little bit of a feeling that I know where I'm going. Okay, so this was uh, King Kani or Kanai. That's the train. We've got some bumper cars up here. 
Brickbuster. Um, okay, so... We haven't really seen... Okay, so we've seen that place. What is here? Floral forest? What is this? Ooh, pretty. Just a nice park. And we've got a, a ride here. Oh. Okay. Uh, botanical Blitz, a spinning spiral. Let's go. Uh, maybe we should take this train. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> or back, sorry, they, the spinning coasters are the worst with this kind of FPS. Uh, yeah, we all know that, but what are you gonna do? Um, okay. It's looking great, though. What else have we got? A wooden coaster? Wait, is this again the... No, we've got a carousel here. And a wooden coaster. Uh, okay, that's that one. Here it is. Rose Rush. Okay. Let's see what it's all about. So many bushes. Then we get into a maze. Wow, these cues. Okay, finally here we are. Let's go. What have we got? So, Rose Rush, uh, Wooden Gnarler, and here are the results. Let's go for a ride.
Okay, quick but fun right here on Rose Rush. Um, and then I saw a Whirly Rick here. Yep, there we go. Cool skin as well. Behind the waterfall. Uh, I really need to do a bird's eye here because... Like, I had no idea there was a Rose Rush in between everything. Okay, and then we've got this center like waterway here. And what have we got there? Okay, so this is all leading to here. Cool. What was this place called? Let's have a quick look. Floral Forest. Okay. We're now on to, I think, what is the last zone? The last 25% of this park. Which is nuts, because for sure the video is already one and a half hour or something. Uh, I have no idea. This place is insane. And I think I need a little break from uh, these mega parks after today. Uh, just do like a mini park in between or something. Uh, Alpine Acres. Wow, these look cool. I like these lanterns. Huge coaster. Look at all these entrances. What is this? Just a lookout point, I'm guessing? Or... Oh, okay, no, that leads to the iron industries. And actually, now that I'm seeing this, I think this might just be... a big coaster. And not that much of uh, the craziness we saw before and all the compactness uh, of the previous zones. Which could be cool. Uh, let's keep the coaster for last, actually. The Redwood Reaper. Cool name for a coaster. Really cool. Is this... Okay, let's just go here. Really cool looking building. Oh, and that's just all for the coaster as well. Wow. Is this the exit, actually, that we're going through? Look how, also, this is fun, like... How perfectly you placed all of these. All the lanterns. Like you thought about everything. If this is the exit. Which uh, I'm think starting to think it is. I think we should just go on it. Let's see if there's anything we're missing by just going on it. Yeah, let's go to the left here first. Uh, to this place. Perfect. There we are. So then we can see that first and then we end off with the uh, coaster. Oh, and there's a log flume as well. Oh, of course. <laughs> Any more rides in here? It's a cool coaster going through there. Gulpy! <laughs> Maplewood Mixer. Ah, looking good. Look at those shops and everything. Also love that I don't have to put any music underneath this. Okay, the Maplewood uh, Mixer. Is this the log flume, or what is this? Okay, is this right? Cool. Look at all the detail just for that flat ride. <laughs> it's insane. Coaster crossing over everything. Vinewood Peak. Is this the log flume then? Oh, cool. That's a smart idea with the logs in there. All the detail in the queue. Look at this rope uh, thingy stacks.
Wow. Okay, a log flume time. Uh, Pinewood Peak, there's it. Chopper's Creek, here are the results. 205 seconds, let's go. And which one? Oh, this is the first one. Let's do it like this. We are back. Really cool log flume. Lots of details. It was great also like going through the um, you know the coaster is just everywhere snaking through this entire place. Um, let's go here quickly. Get some toilets. Get some shops. Here, Oakwood Orbiter. Ah, okay, yeah. Or is this one? 
good. There's, uh, yeah, so this was the part that uh, they were going to finish. But of course, due to the engine limitations, that's impossible. And then we've got the uh, Ferris wheel right here. Okay, but enough of that. Let's get on this coaster. On the Redwood... What was it? Redwood something. Reaper? Yes, the Redwood Reaper. trunks coming out of the uh, the sides there for the queue wow <laughs> so crazy his queues I wonder if there's anything in a mountain peak. And uh, there's just. I'm just gonna cut through it here. There we are. Okay. So, Redwood Reaper. Uh, we've got a wooden. The monster. Here are the results 235 seconds, 2500 meters. Wow. And here are the stats. Okay. Let's uh, put this into test mode. And in seed view. Let's go.
Okay, so this is how you end off a park. Wow. Uh, amazing. I'm also gonna go into bird's eye view right away. Here at the top, a little flag. There we are. Wow, uh, great coaster. Really fun. Uh, I don't know really how smooth it was because of the FPS, but uh, you know, it, it was a really fun experience. And look at this place, everyone. What? What? We came in here, went through Sun... Sunny Plaza or something it was called. We went to the uh, medieval fantasy place. It was here, really like this. Everything is so dense, full of detail. This was, I think, one of the best flat ride skins I have seen, like fantasy-wise, in this park. Maybe the path could use a little bit of work, but I mean, it's probably also a top-down view thing. Yeah, there we go. That's a lot better. Really nice for uh, a flat ride. All these coasters in here. Then we went to the to Westworld. Yep, with this gnarly coaster. Love the theming in here. This is really, really well done Western. So good. I love this coaster. Calamity Canyon. All the buildings. Look at all the. De I didn't even see this because we were on ground level. But all the barrels there. Uh. Cobra Coral, yep, remember those. Uh, train rides. And then we went into everything, you know, over here. The uh, Iron Industries. Look at this place. This was an amazing coaster. Really, really cool. Uh, this feeling on this one. Just the, all the supports, the whole factory feel of the entire zone here. It's just amazing. The... The go-karts were amazing, and then, you know, Alpine can get really boring very quickly. Uh, this one didn't, just because of the theming. You know, you really made it like a logging camp or a logging village and on a mountain, and integrated everything so well that with the log flume and the gnarly wooden coaster going through here, just all the details here, the covering up of the entire coaster here look at that i mean just really well done i really love this place and as i said i think like theming wise this is the park of the year for me so far uh i can't think of anything like we have a lot of realistic ones that were really really good but just from theming to whatever you wanted i mean this this was just this is top of the charts for me and also western so well done it's so difficult. We see a lot of Western and they're all looking the same. This is how you do Western. Uh, so if anyone is building a Western park, look at this. Because this is absolutely how you should do it. Such a great place. I love this. So what did you guys think? Uh, leave a comment down below. Absolutely love this park. It's my favorite so far. So uh, yeah. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Did you like it? Uh, what did you think of the park? Did you like the theming? Uh, I think this was one of the best thing I have ever seen in all the videos I've done. So uh, really great job, Adam. Everyone, thank you very much so much for, for watching. I hope you have a nice day. And we will see you in the next one. Bye now.